All right, and welcome back to another interesting installment of Mind Dust gameplay of sorts. Yeah, and today we're going to be looking at a, um, a mod, the barbecue mod. Yeah. So <laughs> let's go. And if you like what you see here, please consider liking and subscribing. It is greatly appreciated. Thank you. But first, go out to my website here. And we got a couple submissions for photos, which is really, really cool. And I believe, I'm not 100% sure because the, the person did not put in a description of them. But I believe they're from Michael. And if I'm wrong... Um, Please correct me. So the proper person gets the proper credit for it. But this is a small castle. We know that. And by looking at the photo by uh, mind test 4.16, OpenGL 4.5, the both pictures I believe came from the same server. This is the this is a small castle. We got some real cool castle gates going on. There's fencing. Um, I like the colors. I like that dark. Kind of, uh, it's not too dark, but the colors contrast real nicely. Got some waterfall action going on here. Real cool um, landscaping. Yeah. And here's another view of a different castle. Same, uh, I can't even tell what operating system they're using. Looks like Linux. Possibly. But yeah, the... Um, that is cool. Those are some really cool shots. That's a big castle, too. You look at the uh, doorways and stuff. But thank you very much for sending those in. And then there's the uh, there's George's mansion. So it's greatly appreciated sending that in. And you can reach that from my website, rgsproductions2005.com. And... It's mostly kept up to date. <laughs> so <laughs> I got to get better at that. Wow, I'm already starting out slow. Yeah. So the mod we're going to be looking at is the barbecue mod by Grizzly Adam. Huh. It used to be a TV show called Grizzly Adams. And um, it says your dad's barbecue mod. Well, uh, it could have been mom's. You never know. But look at the stuff in this. This is really cool. You got some wood piles going on. You got some uh, condiments, peppercorn, vinegar, molasses, uh, alcoholic beverage. You got a smoker. You got utensils. This is, this is really, really cool. Um, different. You have a kettle uh, cooker and a uh, regular, you know, a, moder a more modern grill. And the smoker. And these wood piles are really neat. So, we are going to go into it. I play in survival. Or, I always do that. I play in creative. Uh, everybody else plays in survival. So, this mod works very well with different farming mods. And um, mobs redo, which I do use. Mobs redo and farming redo. Because when the cow... Um, despawns or you, you take care of the cow. I'm trying to be um, animal friendly correct here. <laughs> so when you take care of the cow, it drops beef. And it has a smoker, kettle cooker, propane grill, um, a beef map for hanging on the wall, and a smoker blueprint because everybody needs the blueprints to their smoker. Uh, charcoal briquettes, uh, a bag of charcoal, Propane, sawdust, tinfoil. I haven't figured out how to use the tinfoil yet. And you have chimney smoke, um, different wood piles of different woods. Uh, uh, your tools, these are cool. Spatula, basting brush, grill brush, peppercorn, ground pepper, paprika. You have all this stuff added. Look at that. Rack of lamb, barbecue chicken, hot wings, um, hot dogs. 
London Broil for the more you know eloquent diners. Uh, I would just rather have a hot dog. <laughs> you have cheesesteak, uh, pizza, and for the vegetarians, you have veggie kebabs. I don't know if tofu, if you can barbecue tofu, um, but I'm sure there, there's a real, there's, there's kind of a cool post in here about, um, it would be nice to see more barbecue food for vegetarians. Um, so he, uh, so he added, uh, corn and I think there was something else that got added on with that oh yeah it grilled mushrooms grilled peppers kebabs stuff like that and they're in there and they're, they're, where did i see that there was a portobello portobello steaks um if you've never had a portobello mushroom you go to the store you get these huge portobello caps and you can dice them cut them up and saute them in a little butter uh 15 20 minutes till they get to your liking and the, these things are phenomenal so yes there are some cool uh, vegetarian kind of um, counterparts. And as usual, the link to this mod and all the other mods I use are in the description of every video. So, it's, and the way that YouTube does it is you'll see the video description and it'll, there'll be like one or two lines and they'll say view more. You, you kind of have to click on that view more button and every single mod that I use, I always incorporate, I put it in the description of every single video. So that helps out people. Because I get that question a lot. And it's not easy to find. YouTube doesn't make it easy, especially if you're using a mobile device. But nevertheless, here's the map of the cow. That's a fine looking cow. And there's the map of the smoker. Very nice. So, we are going to play around. Out here, we're going to put in a barbecue. Open. We're going to take, we're going to get rid of some of this stuff here. That should be enough room. Hmm. I got sticks. Very. Uh, Get rid of some sticks here. And how far back do I want to take this? I'm clearing the dirt away with sticks. I think that'll do. Yeah. So we are going to take this. And I love this. This replacer tool. We're only one back. That's good enough. What is that? Is that a potato? I guess so. It was. So we are going to go there. There. That evens things out a little bit. Nice. So we are going to look at... We're going to look at all of them, but... Um, hmm. I really do like that grill. However... I'm not liking those um, wings, but we'll, we'll leave it. We'll leave it for right now. Uh, do we want? No, we don't want to put the smoker in there because it won't fit. However, I could do. I could do this. Why did I do that? There we go. <laughs> Oh, man, that's what I wanted to do. Yeah, so we are going to use, we are we are going to put a smoker in. Why not? No, we're not. We put it there, we have to go one more over. And now that I'm on, oh, I did it again. That's what I wanted to do. Now we have to change this thing. There we go. There we go. Change that. Because I want to create like a little bit of a wall. I'll get rid of that, that grass. Because 
you don't have grass growing out of rocks. Well, sometimes you do. You never know. So we have a smoker and we have a grill. And let us... I don't have, an, I don't have enough room. So we can get rid of some of this stuff. So what you get with the barbecue mod is you get all these lovely foods. I'm in creative, I'm in, yeah, I said it right that time. I'm in creative mode. So all the food items are going to show up and we have utensils. We have lots of really cool stuff here. Um, we have a grill brush. We have a basting brush, spatula, which is really cool. Propane fuel, vessel shelf. The vessel shelf is from home decor, but the here's smoked paprika, here's ground pepper, which can be stored in a vessel shelf. And there's a kettle grill. The kettle grill is by far my favorite. Look at that. That is sweet. And if you get right on the box, it won't hang. Oh. Come on, you did, there we go. You did it in rehearsal. And we're going to put, we're going to put our basting brush and we're going to hang our, uh, that didn't work. We were going to hang our utensils on there. Okay, so this is how it works. It's basically the same thing as the oven. That's a propane. So let's go get some food. We want, oh, uh, we want a bag of charcoal. We want some... Let's make, and the crafting recipes for all this stuff is real cool. So for, for a hamburger or a hot dog, you're going to take a, a cooked hot dog and a loaf of bread, and you can make it into a, into two hot dogs. Um, we come over to the grilled tomato, which those are, those are really good. And yeah, the tomato in the oven. Cool. Uh, we have grilled corn. We have we have the raw lamb kebab. You know what? I want to take one of those. Uh, it, it, real quickly, you have... I thought you could craft that. Yeah. I don't know what I was clicked on. Uh, it takes propane, glass, and some wrought iron ingots. Uh, for the kettle grill, it takes uh, charcoal lumps and wrought iron ingot. Now, this, this inventory, the unified inventory I'm using, this comes from Dream Builder Pack. So you can go on to, you know, your crafting guide here. And basically, no matter what you click on, it will show you how to craft it. And if you have that stuff in your inventory, you can actually get it. So here's a torch and wrought iron ingots will make your propane tank. <laughs> okay. Tin foil from three tin ingots. All right, and your various other stuff, your wood um, wood planks will get you a wood pile. So we are going to do that. And you get stuffed pepper, sugar, very nice. I'm not going to um, expire a cow. Oh, look at that! Bees showed up. I have bees showing up everywhere. I wonder if they're back by the door over here again. Nope, they were gone. I opened the door and it was almost like Alfred Hitchcock the bees. Okay, so for the smoker, let's see, what do we want to use for fuel? Now, those, um, I'm just going to place this here. You right click on it, you can store stuff in there. What we are going to store in there is, we are going to look for planks. Because, you know, why not? Um, let's get some apple wood. Apple tree planks. There we go. So you right, you right click on there and you put it. You, it doesn't work. Let's go with the standby that I know works. I wonder if it'll work with the apple wood. Ward. Wood. Thank you. Um, we want uh, some Aspen. No, that's not what I wanted. I wanted, it said it takes, I know this works because I did it in 
default tree. And let's go with some apple tree trunk. Yeah. There we go. It took the tree, but it won't take the apple tree. Fine. That's just fine. So let's see if the app, if the cooker will take it. Oh, well, let's get some food here. What do we want to smoke? Um, let us smoke a ham. And for the grill, we are going to cook some raw hamburger patties. <laughs> so for the cooker, we are going to throw in the raw ham. We're going to smoke it with some apple tree, apple wood. Oh, look at that. That that's nice. Okay. For the propane cooker, we are going to give it some propane. And we are going to cook. Um we are going to cook some hamburger patties. There, there, they're they're cooking. Oh, look at that. Nice graphics. Even on the bottom, I think that's a mistake. Now, for this one, we are going to put a bag of charcoal in. Yes, we are. And we, I wanted something different. Uh, what do I want for this grill? Let's put some kebabs and let's get some corn. Grilled corn raw. So, we are going to put... Not 99. We're going to put a, a, about 15 kebabs on there. We have, we're feeding a lot of people. Look at that. Now you take your spatula. Cool. Want to clean your grill? <laughs> you want... I give up. You want to baste? That sounds awful. <laughs> oh, no. Okay. What is, what is, what is our cooker doing here? We have 11 hams. Oh, no, I'm doing 88 hams. It doesn't matter. It does not matter. So we can hang our utensils up here. We can grab them. And yeah, there we go. And that's cooking. So while this is cooking, it's awful dark out here. While this is cooking, we can come back in here. And just for, we're going to put a, a we're not going to put it there. Because we're going, we're going to put it here. We're going to put a vessel shelf here. And we can take our smoked paprika and our ground pepper and put that in there. So there they are. That's how that works with that. And when not using the utensils, we can hang them on the wall. Yes, we can. There we go. So we have our we have our utensils hanging up in our little utility closet. We have our vessel shelf for our extra our extra um condiments. Yeah. Our extra condiments. I'm having way too much fun with this mod. Really. I it no joking. This this is this is just cool. Um and if you don't think I'm if you think I'm kidding. There's my waffle mod. Remember that? Um, the waffles? Yes. I love, the, I love the waffle mod. So anything like this, I definitely... Oh, it's done. Fuel empty. No, the fuel's not empty. We have 15 cooked kebabs. So let us see. Grilled corn. Oh, wait. I didn't cook the corn. There we go. Very, 
Very cool. How are we doing on here? We have 24 of 75. And we have the propane. Um, we have 16 patties. So let's. There we go. We have hamburgers. And then if you take, I believe, if you go back in, I believe, uh, let's see what the crafting recipe is for a hamburger. And that is bread and hamburger patty. So let's find ourselves some bread. And for bread, obviously it's flour creates bread. So we come back in here and we take, we're going to grab some bread and a hamburger patty. And look at that. We have two hamburgers. There you go. That's how that works. I'm going to go back to the daytime. I don't, oh, wait. Let's see. Do I want... Why not? That looks kind of cool. It matches the decor. So we have our little barbecue, backdoor barbecue grill going on here. I'm holding a light. Ah, cool. That, that mod works as intended, the wielding light mod. So, <laughs> that is it. This would look really cool. Now, what... One of the alternatives that I have done in the in the past is I've taken a furnace and let's see here. We have a fuel file fi fuel fired furnace. Say that ten times fast. And let's put a furnace here. So obviously the graphics are, you know, so what I've done in the past is I need that we're going to do this real quickly is because this stuff does not like to be if you right click on it now that won't work because I put that on there huh. oh you know what we're going to do is we can come around back here, do that, and then not what I wanted. There. This is what this is what I have done in the past. Now let's get rid of all our helper blocks. And there you have it. So this is what I've done at some of my other houses. You put a you put a a, a furnace here. Because it works. You could you can cook stuff in here just like you can over here. And why am I cooking enough? Oh, the propane is almost empty. So this creates, and you can use different kinds of materials. This creates like a, a hood door and some some wings, and it will work. You could actually put stuff in there for fuel and you can cook your cook your food. So that's that's one of the alternatives that I've used in the past. However, that graphic is really cool. I would really like to have one without the wings because I could have created a, a real cool wall and countertops around this, but this works fine. And we have, we have our smoker. There's our ham dinner. Take this out. Take the wood out. Shut that down. Still got some fuel left in there. And then, ah, look at that. I did it again. I put too much, uh, too much food. <laughs> too much. That's a lot of food. So that's our raw kebabs. We have, oh. That's our cooked ham. Yeah, we, we, we don't want to throw away good food. That's our raw corn. So what I want to do here. Why am I holding a ham? We want our kebabs and we want our grilled corn and we want to shut that down. I really like, I really like that kettle grill. And the fact that you can hang the utensils off of it. 
So what we have here is we have our grilled corn and you can eat it. it has real cool textures to it. And we have some ham. Now you can't put it down, but you can eat it. So we are not going to waste food. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm not laughing at the mod. I'm laughing at that. I'm actually playing along with this. This is cool. I, I really, I really like that. We have, we have hamburgers. Look at that. We have a full refrigerator. We have our, um, we have our kebabs. So we're going to, we're going to leave one here. Let's see if, um, look at that. We have a kebab. So yeah, that is, and you, you put your cooked food in here. Here, you know, it's just like the oven uses the same principles as the oven, stuff like that. You could really role play the heck out of this. I mean, where else can you find in mind test? You have waffle batter and you have, you have waffle materials and toaster, toaster. Uh, oh, that would be a cool addition. Toaster strudels. And you have this and we, we have our utensils hanging up and in one kitchen, I do have utensils hanging on the wall over the kitchen and it looks really really cool so this mod this mod is cool i i i am really and i love mods like this do you need a mod like this no <laughs> do you want a mod like this absolutely this is really really cool so i'm going to deck out my um patio here a little bit better. We have a smoker, we have a propane, and we have our wood storage, wood pile. The only, the only thing that I would like to see, and what I usually do, is I take a tree, and I don't do that. I take a tree, and I go into the circular saw, and I create, uh, where is it at here? This one. So I grab that, and usually just that one, but you can do different, you know, you can do different things with this. I mean, we, we can grab one of those too. So what I usually do is you have to, it uses one node. So I'll usually place one here, one here, and then turn it to where they're kind of, now the other wood looks better. Kind of you turn it like that, and that represents two logs. And unfortunately, you can't put anything else there. You know, you could you could always uh, put something here. You know, you, you could, there's other things that you can do with it, um, depending on where the logs are. So I, you know, you could put there. You got two different two different style logs. The other tree, the other tree trunk looks better. But that's usually how I replicate uh, logs. I wish there was there was another version of this where they were stacked they weren't stacked in a perfect cube like maybe you could have um a couple logs sitting there I li I, I I like the graphics and the way that they're out but it, it just looks too perfect that that's what I'm getting at other than that that looks cool that's doable I'm going to put that into my area here my little storage area here, but there you have it. Um, this is a really, really cool mod and it adds a whole bunch of other, uh, you know, foods and stuff. Um, you're gonna have to take my word on the cow dropping the beef <laughs> because I am not going to, um, prepare a cow. This is, this is a family friendly video. <laughs> and uh, I was thinking about it, and I was like, well, wait a minute. You know, there's no really good way of taking out an animal, even in Minecraft or Mind Test. I mean, it's not, you know, friendly. So there, there you have it. Th these are really nicely done. They look great. They work great, as expected. You could, you could have a lot of fun with this, create outdoor barbecue. Um, I would like, I would love to have take off these wings so I can incorporate it with, um, 
kind of a counter. I think something like that would look really, really cool. But that right there, that's what a real propane grill looks like. So well done. And <laughs> yeah. As you look you can you can see around everywhere. I love just weird stuff. And that mod is is cool. Uh, along with the waffle mod. I would like to see more stuff like this come out. Um uh, maybe Vanessa can come out with a working coffee pot. <laughs> or you can take the, the, the you could brew coffee. That's an idea. Uh, yeah, because I'm I'm lazy. So yeah. But there you have it. This is the barbecue mod by Grizzly Adam. Links will be in the show notes. Uh, as always, if you like, uh, please uh, like, subscribe, share. Uh, thank you for watching. And until the next video, everybody have a fantastic week. And goodbye.